everybody, it's Dreja here. Um, welcome back to my channel. So today is Monday, February 10th, and um, I kind of just wanted to record this because um, I want to start recording my life with chronic illness and also living with pseudotumor cerebri. So, and chronic pain, ugly angle, I'm, I apologize. But as you can see here, I am using my heating pad. I actually have my back brace on today. Um, and the reason why is because I'm in a lot of pain today. Um, a lot of shoulder, neck pain, and a lot of head pain. Just everything pain. Um, I wasn't in a lot of pain the past, I would say, two, three days. I did have a little bit of back pain, but it wasn't as bad. And today is about a 9, 10. The other couple of days were probably about a 5, 6. But today is a really bad day. And when it's a really bad day, I use my heating pad, which is on all the way up. I will show you. It's on 6 all the way up. It's on for two hours. Today's just not a really good day for me. Um, basically laying in my bed. Um, I woke up today. I didn't go to bed till like 3 in the morning. And then I woke up about 11 o'clock. I felt really nauseous today. And my stomach has been bothering me. Um, the past week, I'd say, like five days or so, I've been feeling nauseous, really, really tired. I stopped taking my muscle relaxers for like three days because they've been making me sleep too long and they make me feel like drowsy and stuff. So I stopped taking that and I think my iron is getting low again. So I'm pretty sure I have an appointment that I have to get my blood work done March or April. So um, I think that's also affecting me as my iron's going low. So my body is starting to like react. I don't know. I was good for the past two, three days with pain, but today is just all catch it up with me. Um, I did a lot those past two days. I was at the dealership all day. Not yesterday, the day before. It was very busy, very go, go, go type of days. I did my hair, I brushed it out and put it in two different braids. And my hands started cramping up my wrist and my hands, my joints, a lot of my joints today are bothering me as well. So today I'm Today's just going to be a chill day, a recovery day for my body. And I think um, I caught something on the from the plane when I went on the plane. Um, because I woke up today, my throat, I've, I couldn't even talk. Like, I had to clear my throat and I had, like, and my ears have been bothering me and my nose and my head. So I think it's my allergies and also I think I might have caught something like a bug or something from the plane. I did wear my mask, but whatever you still catch stuff by touching stuff and i don't know i hope every everybody's having a good day I, I did post my hair routine today at two i think it was like 2 15 when i posted it before i got in the shower so that video should be up i guess try to update you guys later see how i feel later on but i'll see you guys later peace out love you Hey everybody, it's Dreja here. Sorry you really can't see me because it's 10 o'clock at night and all my lights are off besides my fish tank. But I kind of just wanted to update um, since the last time today. So I don't know the last time I updated. But after I updated, I read a couple of chapters of my book. I laid there for a little bit. And then I went with my mom, I went with my mom to um, Publix to... Just bring red boxes. The red, I was just, I really didn't want to go. I was falling asleep, but I didn't, I wanted, didn't want to go, but she likes when somebody goes with her, so. And then when I got back, I watched um, all my chapters again on my book, and then I fell right to sleep, and I've been sleeping since about like 8.50, 8.55 since my alarm woke me up. And I woke up with a massive headache and like thumping behind my eyes. That's why I have this ice pack on top of my head. I have, still have my heating pad. You can't see it, but my heating pad is there for my neck and my shoulders um, because my neck is hurting as well. 
So today has just been a really rough day of health days. And I think it's because I was going, going, going the last three days. And my body is finally catching up um, on me. And I still in a lot of pain. I just took my medicines at... I took them a little bit early. <laughs> Because my mom came in my room and was like, oh, you were sleeping for so long. I just wanted to remind you to take your meds. I was supposed to take them at, I usually take them at 9.45, but I took them at like 9.15. So I was about, whatever, get it in my system. So it should be starting to help in a little bit. Um, sometimes my meds take a little bit, uh, take a little while to kick in. I'm just laying here. I'm going to watch some YouTube videos for a little bit. And then, kind of, hopefully I don't stay up all night. I'm tired anyways. I just hope this headache goes away. But I just wanted to update you guys whenever I'm having a health bad health day. This is basically what it looks like with chronic illness or anything like that. Any type of illness. It's not fun and games. This is what basically what we do. We lay in bed, try to let our bodies recover from either the day or the couple of days that we had good health days it usually catches up on us this day i'm recovering i don't know what tomorrow looks like hopefully it's better if it's not you know just let my body recover so that's been happening all day feeling good enough to take a shower it didn't hit me until after i took a shower so this ice pack on my head with the rag heating pad just laying here in my bed all day kind of just relaxing i did put because my hands were arthritis in my hands and my wrist i can't get it now because the ice is gonna fall but it's this like um cream that i use that's from my mom's doctor it was like samples i put some of that on i'm gonna put some more on when i'm done with this video that helps with my arthritis in my hands and my wrist so i just wanted to update i'll let you guys know how I feel tomorrow, I can like, uh, naps since I got my iron infusions and my iron went, went up like to 15. So I think my iron's going back down. It's been f five months now since my last iron infusion. So I think my iron, I'm um, going lower. That's probably why, because I was having symptoms the past couple of days, like nausea and tiredness all around, all different things for low iron so if i start feeling like this still all week and then next week i'm gonna call my doctor see if we can get blood work done early and see what's gonna go down go down but as of right now i'm just gonna leave her alone so i just wanted to update real quick that's it bye i'll talk to you guys later or tomorrow love you thank you for watching Hey everybody, it's Dreja here. It's the next day, so um, sorry if you hear people in the background. That's my family. I'm feeling a lot better. My throat is still hurt and my back still hurt, and but my head and my eyes are not hurting anymore. I had a really rough night. Um, I got up. I got up at three. I went to bed at one. At one, and then I I got up at three, and then. I got up at five and then I got up finally at 10 and I've been up since. So feeling pretty good today. It's just my back's hurt really bad. My throat is hurting. So I'm just about to watch my TV shows. Come here, Cass, hurry up. Say hi. Say hi to YouTube. <laughs> I'm being bad, give kiss. Give him a kiss. <laughs> 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 Looks like you're saying hi well, to I, yourself. Like yeah. Nice, your brother. Your brother. Um, but this is my nephew. Look, Cash. Say hi. Say hi to you, too. Oh, he don't want to say hi. But other than that, I'm feeling um pretty good. I'm just in a lot of pain. Oh, don't jump. I think I think just I'm sick and my iron's low, so that's why. But I took my meds and they kicked in. My back's not hurting that much, but I'm about to watch my shows. Um, 
Hopefully you can hear me because what are you throwing? But I'm about to watch The Good Doctor, 911 Lone Star, and Prodigal Son. So this is what I do all day. Now I'm sitting on my, my couch. Doing good other than that. So I'll talk to you later.